Yo, what's up guys? Today in this video, I'm going to show you the most scripted match in FC Mobile. I played a lot of terrible and scripted games in FC Mobile, but this one was just unbelievable. You already saw uh, my opponent, how many trophies uh, was he, you can see his team, his uh, maxed uh, he, all his players are max rank and 30 training levels, so the match started and the first chance was for our opponent. Uh, good defending from us and uh, he still got the ball. Cross palm here and he somehow managed to score. EA Sports nerfed the cross palm, but somehow he managed to score a uh, goal with a uh, header. So yeah, terrible start in this game. And uh, I immediately tried to score goal, but what a save from Thibaut Courtois. Amazing save and the first big situation in this game. Just look at this. What the hell was that? He didn't even press a single button to do this. The AI did this. He did nothing, bro. The game saved him. Amazing Clearance from the goal line, another chance for us, Mo Salah with the ball, chance, and again, he did nothing, the AI defending this, and uh, the second chance, uh, the second uh, corner here, but uh, nothing, terrible start of this game, he had only one attack in the entire game, in the entire first half, I tried to cross pump, but look at this guys, what is Berbatov doing, he's gullied, Scored an amazing header, no problem, but my Berbatov didn't even try to jump and take the shot with his header. Only one attack for our opponent in the first half. This was his second attack in the match and uh, terrible, terrible. He did absolutely nothing and this is another chance for our team. As you can see, uh, the score hasn't changed, but uh, Berbatov is now with the ball. Amazing chance for our for our team, amazing pass for Salah, and what a save from Thibaut Courtois, literally, perfect chance for goal, and Mo Salah 99 overall, didn't score, but that was not enough, because look at this, another clearance from the goal line, he did nothing in this situation, and the game saved him, out to clean from his defender, and just look at this, he's Player is 1v1 versus the goalkeeper, amazing defending here, but he somehow manages to keep the ball, look at his R9, he was on the, he was on the ground bro, and he somehow managed to get the ball, and he's that bad, our opponent is that bad, that he didn't even uh, score the 1v1 situation, terrible uh, opponent bro, yeah, he was 100,000 trophies uh, over us, but uh, we managed to score in the 88th minute and that was nothing because the situation that you're going to see here okay we finally managed to score we deserve this the, the all the game we are only making attacks some super clear situation 100% chances and we didn't manage to score because of the script but now I want you to look at my Ricardo Carvalho defending just look what Ricardo Carvalho did, just look at him, look at him, I didn't even press anything bro, and he just moved out of the way, he just moved, why, what is Ricardo Carvalho doing, he just opened some space for our opponent, so he can get the perfect situation here, and that's exactly what happened, perfect skill move and perfect finish, Ricardo Carvalho, I didn't even press anything guys, anything, and Ricardo Carlo just moved. And one more thing that I want to mention is that the referee gave him five minutes at a time. And I just want to show you the next game, the exact next game. Just look at the time. Just look at the time. Okay, where the game is finishing, 90 minutes and zero minutes. And he blows the whistle immediately, bro. Not even one second after we hit the 90 minute, bro. The terrible script bro, terrible game and I just want to show you what happened in the next game bro as you can see I lost 6-1 but did I actually lost 6-1 or I just lost to a hacker 
Let's look at his matches and he's winning every single game with six goals and what happened in this game? The first half ended and he scored an own goal and I was uh, leading in the game 1-0 for me and what happened next? I got disconnected from the game guys. I just got an error as you can see, disconnection error and as you can see the score is even 0-0, the score was 1-0 for me. And when I just look at my last matches, I see that I lost 6-1. What the hell, bro? What is happening with those hackers? I'm reporting them all of the time, but they are just not getting banned. And as you can see, in the top 5 players in the world, they're all freaking hackers. This guy is winning the first in the world, is winning every game 1-0. 1-0 every single game, the second in the world, he's winning every game, 1-0 guys, they're all hackers, it's not normal, this is a, this is a huge game guys, FC Mobile is a huge game, and EA Sports have to do something because all of the top 3 players in the world, the best players in the world are just hackers, just look at their scores. It's just so obvious that they are hackers. Okay, maybe the fourth in the world is not a hacker, but we cannot be sure, 100% sure. Look at look at this guy. Five matches and three of them have no result. And guess why? Because the opponents that he faced were hackers too. They were hackers too, bro. And the match just finished with no result. They are not losing games. They are winning literally everything. And that is literally disgusting, bro. Because I'm giving a lot of money for this game. A lot of people are investing a lot of money for this game. And then I'm going to play uh, the first thing that happened, as you can see, this scripted game uh, versus a maxed rank up team with 30 level players. Just look at this team, guys. Look at this team. All of his players are the max rank up level and they're the max training level guys just look at those stats R9 what the hell is that 142 pace 142 pace guys look at all of those cards Balak max level Van Dyke max level and this is his gold card 139 defending bro this is unbelievable look at this core to a card he has three stats that are over uh, 150 overall. This is unbelievable, guys. This is a lot of money, a lot of coins. He probably spent thousands of dollars to make this team. It's not easy, guys. I'm I'm spending money too, and I have uh, not even a single player that is uh, max training level. I have two players that are on the max rank up level, but I just don't have enough coins to max them, bro. It's just literally impossible. You have to spend thousands and thousands of dollars, bro. And not every single person on the planet can afford that. There are some people that cannot spend even five dollars on the game. And EA Sports are just disrespecting them. And okay, what about the players that are spending thousands? hundreds of dollars and then they are facing hackers like me i want to make content i'm spending the money only to make pack openings and huge content for my channel but what is happening then i i i face hackers i face freaking hackers why 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 don't you just ban them just ban them it's super easy you have to be stupid to not understand that all of those players in top five in the world in head to head are freaking hackers because I'm facing them and I see what is happening. I always get this disconnection error. I'm leading. I have one nail lead and then somehow it, it says disconnection error and no reason. What the hell is that? Look at my team, guys. I have an amazing team. I have an amazing team, guys. And then I'm losing to hackers. EA Sports are just being disrespectful to us, guys, that are just trying to enjoy the game and play with players that we enjoy and like in real life. I just feel like that EA Sports are just... They, they just don't care about us, guys. I don't know what you think. Let me know in the comment section. I'm really interested to see what do you think about uh, this. And uh, yeah, guys, if you agree with me, make sure to leave a like on the video and subscribe for the channel.